A six-year-old boy beaten to death, and the suspect, an LAUSD employee and acquaintance of that child's mother who had been caring for him for days. Now, while that man is being held on $2 million bail tonight, the LAPD is continuing its investigation. And the little boy's family is grieving and searching for their own answers. CBS 2's Jake Reiner now live in South L.A. with more on this. Jake? Jeff and Pat, a large group of that family, came here to the school to meet with officials to talk to them about their policy regarding staff members and meeting with students off campus. Now, what they found out was is that this particular employee, according to the school district, violated that policy. Justice for Davon! Justice for Davon! Six-year-old Davon Taylor can't speak for himself anymore, so his family is fighting for him. I won't. Justice for my son, and I need answers. Family members say Davon first met 23 year old Tyler Deshaun Martin Brand at Normandy Elementary in South LA as a part of an after school program. Martin Brand was a coach, and according to the family, an acquaintance of Davon's mother. When school started back, he started being with the coach like every weekend. When Davon died shortly after Christmas, investigators say he was with Martin Brand outside of school hours off campus. Police say the boy was beaten to death. Martin Brand was arrested and is now charged with murder. I had to bury a grandson. He ought to be burying me. Davon's family met with school officials this afternoon. LAUSD responded to us with this statement saying in part, Los Angeles Unified will conduct a comprehensive investigation to determine the extent to which Mr. Martin Brand violated our policy pertaining to non-school hour access and association with students. I do forgive him what he did, but I won't forget. Thank you. Martin Brand is in jail tonight being held $2 million bail. I'm Jake Reiner, CBS2 News.